Look at that, guys. All right, we're going to turn that off. Stop it. Very nice. Very, very nice, guys. So this thing works perfectly. Everything works. Now, this is a tray that you pull out. You lift this up, and that allows you to clean inside and get rid of everything inside there. Overall, an amazing machine. Oh, hi, my friends. Welcome back to another unboxing. Today, we are checking out this ice maker so come on let's go see if it actually performs as good as i think it will so very quick run down 44 pounds a day hot water cold water ice cube so let's go ahead and show you guys what it looks like you guys can open this and this access your back so for any reason you need to get to anything this is your back tray if you got any leak or anything going on down there you can lift stuff up and play with everything inside here. And then if you look underneath it, this is your release little plugs. So this will allow you to drain the water if you're done and the unit's not plugged in and you're done using it. So it will drain the water from those plugs. You just pull the plugs out. All right guys, so we're gonna actually test this, see if it works with our power station. We're gonna see how many watts it pulls. So just under normal idle at six watts which is not bad at all um so you can unlock it and lock it hot water ice block cold water settings and then you just tap to turn it off um so as you see we need to add water so we're going to go ahead and do that but uh okay so now it's not taking near as many watts that was just to turn it on so let's go ahead and add some water and see how this performs. So it already sensed that we added water and the add water light went away. So it still says add water because we only add just one little cup. So we're gonna keep adding water until it completely goes away. So when it's locked, you can't actually use it. So when you press the unlock, so that means it's locked. As you press hot, it won't work. So once the unit's on, you actually want to um, wait because obviously it's not gonna pour ice right away. So if you do ice, so now it's turning on. So obviously there's no ice, so it can't come out because we haven't had you know water in long. It's only been a minute or two. Press to lock or unlock the hot water button. So that's what the lock and unlock is. Um, ice making indicator light. Light on means tank is full. Light flash means it's making ice cubes. For cooling indicator. Light on means cold water ready. Light flash means water is cooling. So as you see, it's blinking for hot water. That means that it's heating. So it will be a solid light when everything's ready. So if you tap everything, it will be solid, kind of like it is here when everything's ready. And then when it's ready, then you press the buttons down here. So keep that in mind. So obviously we didn't add plenty enough water, but we're just playing with this. It's This thing is amazing, guys. Um, once we actually fully learn it, I'm I'm happy already. So I'm... Yeah, as you guys can see, we're not even near close. You can add a lot, a lot, a lot of water in this thing, my friends. A lot. Really, really nice. So I've come to learn that people actually use this as well to hold ice, which is strange. I thought, you know, so what people do is they fill this up with some ice. Then they place this back on here to get extra water or something out of that. That's interesting. So <laughs> there's a lot to learn. Um, so for our power bank... When it's heating up, it's taking 284, I did see 294 watts for heating. That's actually really low. So a lot of power stations are going to be able to uh, run this. Let's try doing, let's see, let's try doing ice block at the same time. So we're going to see what watts it actually goes up to. So we're doing ice, we're doing hot water. Now, I'm not sure if you can do everything at once. I mean, seems like it is. So 289 watts, 290, 291. 
not bad at all so far i'm super impressed let's do cold water at the same time all three at the same time let's see what the watts it does 295 watts so far i am just so impressed with this guys yeah less than 300 watts on everything running that's insane that is so impressive we might have to add more water with doing all of this at the same time. This unit is seriously impressive, my friends. Absolutely impressive. Oh, we can hear the hot water heating up. Just impressive. So that makes sense. So basically, if you want hot water, you have to press unlock and then press hot. Because nothing, see, yeah, nothing happens. That's just a safety feature. For all the other ones, you don't have to press you know unlock you can just press the button so again as it's blinking that means it's um, cooling it's making and it's heating once it's cold water is ready once ice blocks are ready once hot water is ready it will be solid light just like the unlock absolutely one of the best ice makers I've ever reviewed Okay guys, with everything going on, we hit 403 watts so far. That's the highest, so 404, uh, 406, that's the highest we've hit so far. Um, which ours can go up to 1200 watts, so <laughs> we're nowhere near. 413, so if you have a big enough power station, you can take this portable. Like, you got a mountain cabin, you're going on a trip, whatever, you can take this with you. This is so amazing! absolutely amazing so 416 is about we're just slowly climbing a little bit over there and that's because every now that, that's with everything on at once so keep that in mind if you turn just one on you're not going to have such high watts so this is just doing everything all at once because we want to put this you know we want to actually test this out so 419 is what we were last at that's what it's hovering at 419 watts not bad at all that's less than uh most space heaters on medium or low most space heaters on medium to low are 500 watts so and the 418 so 419 it topped out at wow so cool guys so guys um even though it's still blinking i'm just testing it out the hot water and it is hot so don't do this at home like i can't keep my finger under there it is very very hot and it's not even fully done yet but we're just playing we're just testing this so oh we hear ice cubes all right we're gonna go ahead we're gonna stop the heating we don't need it but yeah this is awesome so we hear ice cubes forming now for ice keep it straight down for cold straight down and so forth all right we're gonna give it a shot as you guys can hear the ice even though it's still blinking we're gonna see if we got some ice so it gives us nice blue light so I'm not sure oh there we go I don't know if you guys can see that but the ice dropped down in there we go there we go. <laughs> this is cool guys <laughs> so yeah it had some ice look at this Look at that, guys. All right, we're going to turn that off. Stop it. Very nice. Very, very nice, guys. So this thing works perfectly. Everything works. Now, this is a tray that you pull out. You lift this up, and that allows you to clean inside and get rid of everything inside there. Overall, an amazing machine.